Did you know that your dog's sense of smell is 1,000 to 10 million times more sensitive than yours? That's right. Our furry friends experience the world in a way we can only dream of. With their supercharged snouts, they can sniff out the most subtle scents, making every walk an adventure filled with exciting new aromas. This incredible canine capability sets the stage for our exploration today. Now that we've got your attention, let's dive into the things you should show your dog. Why should you show things to your dog, you might wonder? Well, there are a few compelling reasons. First off, your furry friend thrives on mental stimulation. It's not all about physical exercise. Just like us, dogs need to engage their minds. Showing them various things provides this much-needed brain workout. Secondly, it's all about bonding. When you share experiences and discoveries with your dog, it strengthens your connection. Think of it as a shared adventure, a mutual journey of exploration. Lastly, let's not forget about innate curiosity. Dogs are naturally curious creatures. They love to sniff, explore, and learn about their surroundings. So presenting them with new things satisfies this inherent curiosity and keeps them engaged. In essence, Showing things to your dog isn't just a fun activity. It's an essential part of their mental well-being, bonding, and overall happiness. Understanding this, let's move on to what exactly you should show your dog. First on our list is new environments. Variety, as they say, is the spice of life. And this holds true for our canine companions as well. Just as we humans thrive on change and novelty, our dogs too can benefit from being exposed to different environments. Imagine you're a dog. Each new place is a smorgasbord of smells, sounds and sights, all waiting to be explored. This sensory stimulation can be incredibly exciting for our four-legged friends, keeping their minds sharp and their spirits high. Now consider the parks, the beaches and the trails. Each of these places offers a unique environment for your dog to explore. Parks, with their wide open spaces, can be great for dogs to run around and burn off energy. Beaches, on the other hand, offer a completely different sensory experience. The feeling of sand under their paws, the smell of the sea, the sound of the waves, all of these can be fascinating for a dog. And trails with their diverse flora and fauna can offer an enriching wilderness experience. But it's not just about fun and games. Introducing your dog to new environments can also help them become more adaptable and less anxious. It can help them learn to cope with new situations and experiences, making them more confident and well-rounded. So the next time you're planning a day out, why not take your dog along and let them experience the world in all its varied glory? That's it for new environments. Now let's move on to the next item. Next on our list is interactive toys. Now these aren't just your run-of-the-mill squeaky toys, oh no, we're talking about a whole different ball game. Let's start with Puzzle Toys, a brilliant invention that challenges your dog's problem-solving skills. These toys come in all shapes and sizes, each with its own unique set of challenges. Some are filled with treats that your furry friend can only access by solving the puzzle. Imagine the joy on their faces when they crack the code. Now let's talk about Chew Toys. Not only do they satisfy your dog's natural urge to chew, but they also promote dental health. They come in a variety of textures and materials, from rubber to rope, each providing a different kind of sensory experience for your dog. Interactive toys are a fantastic way to keep your dog entertained, and they have the added bonus of stimulating your dog's mind. Think of them as a workout for your dog's brain, keeping them sharp and alert. But remember, while these toys are a great tool, they're not a replacement for quality time with you. So, make sure to balance playtime with these toys with good old-fashioned bonding time. So, keep those interactive toys handy. Now, on to the next thing. Another thing to show your dog is other animals. It's like opening a whole new world for them, filled with different shapes, sizes, and scents. This is not just about curiosity, though. It's about socialization an essential part of any dog's life. You see, dogs are naturally social creatures, descendants of wolves who lived and thrived in packs. They crave interaction, not just with humans, but with their fellow four-legged friends as well. This interaction helps them learn important lessons about behavior, boundaries, and communication. 
But here's the thing. Socialization isn't just about letting your dog loose in a park filled with other dogs. It's a gradual process that requires patience and understanding from you, their trusted human. Start with controlled encounters. Maybe a friend's well-behaved pet or a calm animal from a local shelter. Keep these meetings short, sweet, and positive. Gradually increase the time and introduce more animals. Always monitor these interactions and step in when necessary. Remember, you want to create positive experiences, not traumatic ones. So if you see signs of discomfort or aggression, it's time to step back and try again later. And don't forget about other species, too. Cats, rabbits, horses, they can all become part of your dog's social circle, expanding their understanding of the world around them. Remember, socialization is key to a happy, well-adjusted dog. Now let's wrap things up. So we've covered new environments, interactive toys, and other animals. But the list doesn't stop there. We've journeyed together through a world of possibilities, all in the name of enriching the lives of our four-legged companions. We've explored the benefits of exposing our dogs to new environments, from bustling parks to serene beaches, highlighting the importance of variety in their routines. We've delved into the world of interactive toys, discovering how they can provide mental stimulation and physical exercise, all while offering hours of fun. And let's not forget the other animals we introduced. The potential for social interaction, learning and play that these encounters can provide is immense, whether it's with another dog in the park or a cat in the comfort of your home. But remember, every dog is as unique as a snowflake. What may excite one might not necessarily interest another. It's all about understanding your dog's preferences, their likes and dislikes, their fears and curiosities. It's about showing them love, care, and respect. And in return, they will reward you with unconditional loyalty and companionship. So, continue this journey. Uncover more things to show your dog. Maybe they'll enjoy a new type of treat, a different kind of music, or even a change in your daily routine. The world is their oyster, and you, my friend, are their guide. And as you embark on this exciting adventure, we're here to help you every step of the way. We'll continue providing you with insights, tips, and tricks, tailored to make your life as a pet parent easier and your bond with your dog stronger. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your fellow dog lovers, and hit that subscribe button for more informative content about our furry friends. Thanks for watching.